and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX. Alright, so last time we cleared the Stormy Sea, and it turns out there are rumors of a new dungeon going around. Let's go check out the square. Alright, who wants to tell me about the new dungeon? Lombre, is it you? It's you. Why is it always Lombre? This is true. We have run into dungeons where there are literally items in the walls before. Alright, let's go ask Shiftry about this. Actually, wait, hold on a second. Where is Shiftry? Usually they're hanging out around here. Where the heck is Shiftry? Are they near the uh, post office? I don't know where Shiftry is. Hold on. Diglett, do you know anything? Huh. Highly doubt that, but... Well, that was weird. Anyways, like I was saying, we're looking for Shiftry right now to tell us about the Buried Relic. Uh, oh, there they are. Alright, Jungle in the Southeast. So we could go there. This is actually a completely optional dungeon, but there are some legendaries we can actually recruit there. Cause let me double check something about the buried relic. Hold on. This is this the dungeon I'm thinking of? Yep, this is the dungeon I'm thinking of. It is 99 floors deep. So yeah, this is going to be one of the longer dungeon dives. We're not doing this right now, though. We'll do that at some point, because there are actually a couple of legendaries we can recruit throughout the dungeon. But for now, I think we're going to take a break from the really long dungeon to do some side missions. Because at this point, there are more unlocks we can do, but we need to basically pass time. So we're going to go do some side missions while we're waiting. Uh, before we do anything, though, I need to clean up my inventory. Kangaskhan, we're not going there quite yet. We'll go sometime. But yeah, we're not going there until we're fully prepared. Okay, so what do I not need? I don't need... Hmm. Don't need Carbos, Plain Seed. We didn't use as many Reviver Seeds as I thought we would. I mean, I'm not complaining. That's actually a good thing. Uh, we have an Escape Orb, One-Shot Orbs. Okay. So yeah, let's go back and just do some side missions then. Something easy, just to make time go by uh, faster. They really want me to go to the Relic, don't they? Alright, what do we have here? Apple, I'll take that. Max Ethers. Wow. Yeah, I don't know why they stopped, like, carrying Reviver Seeds. I don't think that's a thing that happens in the post game, but I guess it kind of started happening. Also, Tyranitar, there are several ranks higher than Gold Rank. In fact, I think we're about to hit Gold Rank, aren't we? Have you guys literally been doing nothing since you hit Gold Rank? Gold Rank isn't even the highest. Yeah, like they've been saying. Yeah, we already heard about Lucario. Alright, anyway, speaking of ranks, let's go pick up a few missions. Well, you know what we could do, actually? We could also just burn through all of the old missions I have. You know what? This is probably the better idea. I'm going to go through some of the old missions we have. Alright, so what do we want to do then? Uh, whoops. Solar Cave, Unknown Relic. You know what we could do? Hold on. What we could do is we can either go to... Where are they? Dark Knight Relic, which I don't think we've been to before yet. In fact, yeah, we could go to Dark Knight Relic... And just do these two missions. Or we could go to Unknown Relic and do these two missions. These two are going to be a whole lot easier. But these ones are S rank, so they'll give me more points. Dodrio and Radita. Or not, uh, what is it? Executor and Radita. We could recruit them. Actually, I don't think we have Radita yet. We definitely have Executor. I'm not sure if I'm going to keep them, but I guess we could... We could try... 
You know what? Screw it. It's also been a while since I've actually spent time with the main party. Hey, Hank. So, yeah, you know what? Let's go. Uh, before we go, though, one second. Just gonna take, like, 2,000 Pokey with me, just in case. More Max Ethers. And let me see something. I want to also double-check if I can relearn any moves for Hank. Oh, yeah, I did accidentally get rid of Psychic when I was experimenting with moves earlier, so I had to put Confusion back on. Unfortunately, yeah, I guess you can't relearn H or ATM moves. Oh, well. I want to see something, though. Hank, can you learn... You can't learn Heat Wave, can you? No, it doesn't look like it. You could learn Blaze Kick. Actually, Blaze Kick might be a good idea. Hold on, we might want to replace Flame Charge with that then. Yeah, you know what? Well, travel Speed isn't as good. Let's get a good, like, fire move on her. Whoop, nope, nope, nope. Don't want to relearn anything for her. Uh, can I relearn anything? Nothing I really... I could put Hydro Pump on. Um, mm. At this point, that... Uh, we would have to get rid of probably Water Gun for that, or Ice Beam. Or Fury Swipes. Actually, you know what? Screw it. Why do I even have Fury Swipes on? It can be good, but at this point, I want Hydro Pump. Okay. Another thing we can do here is actually after we reach the post game, I forgot to actually show this off, but we can actually basically move tutor our Pokemon. Oh, I don't have enough money with me. Whatever. We can actually move tutor certain moves on. Is there anything good here we can learn? We have pledges, Thunder Punch. Oh, there's Heat Wave. Oh, it's 10,000 Pokey though. But that's actually really worth it. Okay, one second. Hold on. It's been like seven minutes already and we haven't been to a dungeon yet. But we are going to go to the dungeon soon. What I want to do is... You know what? Fine. Let's teach Hank Heat Wave. Because like I said, Heat Wave, kind of a really good enemy only move. Or like, enemy hitting only move. Because yeah, I also looked at Surf. Turns out Surf hits everyone, not just enemies. So it's not that great when you're like in a team. However, Heat Wave specifically only hits enemies. Alright, let's get rid of... Not Double Kick, I want you to have some fighting move. You know what, screw it, let's get rid of Flame Burst for now. Or we'll relearn that later if we need to. Okay, there we go. Alright, let me do a little bit more inventory management. I want to make sure I have everything I need. Oh, you know what I do also want to do? I kind of want to go grab... How many Reviver Seeds do I have? Four? Five. That's more than enough. I also kind of want to grab the Joy Ribbon back out. Yeah, let's grab that Joy Ribbon again. Or not Joy Ribbon, uh, Friend Scarf. Friend Ribbon. Friend Bow. I can't think of the name of the item. There we go. Friend Bow. We also have some Gold Ribbons I can sell if I really need money. Alright, let's go. Let's go explore the Dark Knight Relic for a bit. It is... Actually, it is only 15 floors down. Hmm. Might not be a terrible idea just to go all the way. Alright, we're gonna put the Friend Ribbon back on, because I don't think traps are as big a deal here. Efficient Bandana on Hank. X-Ray Specs are always a good option on your third Pokémon. I think we're good. Yeah, we'll bring Magnezone, why not? I'll probably train up more Pokemon in the meantime, but for now, this is our main team. Alright, let's go. Hopefully I didn't forget anything important. Wait, do I have a friend area for Rat? I should have a friend area for Ratata. If not, it's not that hard to recruit Ratata. Okay, anyways. So yeah, this dungeon is... A swamp, apparently. I don't remember this place being a swamp. Actually, I definitely don't remember this place being a swamp. Did they change that? Actually, I don't really remember this dungeon at all, to be honest. 
I know we can get ghost types here, which could be good. I just need a Pokemon that can go through walls to get, like, to, like, grind up, uh, not healing items. To grind up stat items in, like, Unknown Realmic or something. Okay, I do have a camp for you. Alright, come along. Wow, you are level 46. Hmm. Hopefully we don't die here. I didn't realize how... Do I have a cleanse orb with me? I don't think I have a cleanse orb with me. Oh, power up orb, that's fine. We'll clean that up when we get out of here. Maybe we should have kept the goggles on so that I could see all the traps. Also, I didn't even see you there, Ghastly. Oh, by the way, I have psychic moves. I do need to see if I can find myself another psychic TM. It was a really dumb move of me to overwrite psychic. Oh well, it'll pop up eventually. I should, yeah, I should also double check uh, TM shops every once in a while. I really thought you could. I really thought you could relearn. Uh, what I call them? I thought you could relearn TM moves, but I guess not. Oh, stairs. Oh, by the way, actually, speaking of stairs. I just realized something. I didn't actually look up... Oh, I don't have that many apples. Uh, I didn't actually look up what floors I need to go to. 6 and 12. Okay. Seriously? Oh, grudges. Oh, no. Well, bye! Oh, no. <laughs> No, guys, don't use the good moves. You were, you're fine, I don't care about you. Alright, we're gonna need... That's a new trap. We're gonna need to make sure we use a Max Elixir next floor. Oh, that's actually a really annoying trap. There's a fainted Pokemon. I don't have any apples to spare. Because I didn't bring enough apples. Fortunately, we still have a ton of Max Ethers and Elixirs. Wow, you, lo you lost a lot of PP on Ember. Is it Discharge? Yeah, it's just Discharge. That's fine. I need to also make sure I power up Heat Wave. I really wish it was a good water type, or like room type, room type? Room wide water type move I can put on Psyduck, Skullduck. But honestly, the only really good one is Surf. And Surf has the unfortunate thing where it has friendly fire. I think. Pretty sure it has friendly fire. It did when I was doing some testing. Alright, I'm backing up. Just gonna let my health regen naturally for now. Oh, give me that. I need that. Stairs. Let's keep going. So we need to reach floor 6, and we are floor... That's actually bad. I kind of needed Reviver Seeds. Those are kind of really important to me. Yeah, we're moving on. I can't spare the apples at this point. Reviver Seeds are one of the items I don't need to be sticky at the moment. Oh, okay, that was close. Hey, Hank, you wanna help out a bit? You, you know, use Ember or something? Hank, what are you doing? Why aren't you helping? Hold on, Hank, why weren't you doing anything? Oh, is it because we're in a dark hallway? Or did I accidentally turn off all your moves? No, your moves are working. Oh, yeah, you know what's happening. It's the vision thing. Speaking of vision. 
So this dungeon has dark hallway, so they can only see one square ahead of them. So they don't actually know I'm under attack. In fact, you know what? I'm gonna come back here real quick and just blindly fire into the darkness. Because the AI knows there's something there, but unless I'm controlling them, they can't attack any further than a single square ahead of them. Yeah, the vision, or the AI works weird in this game, like I said before. Especially in, like, room-wide moves where it can hit things that I really shouldn't be able to hit. And then hallways like this, they just don't know what's happening. There is no communication between us, apparently. We can't just, like, turn behind us and tell them that there's a Pokemon in front that you should probably start attacking. We don't really communicate on this team. We really need to work on that. I mean, it doesn't help that we're technically still a silent protagonist. Oh no, there's that one time we spoke. Like, briefly. Yeah, there was no way we could sneak by there. Okay, now seriously though, where are the stairs? There they are. Ooh, that... What? What just happened? Did... No, wait, no, seriously, what the heck just happened? None of my team members got knocked out. How'd they get awakened? I guess they... Uh... They're attacking each other. Why are they attacking each other? What is happening in this dungeon? I don't know if that was a thing in the original, because... In the original, Awakened State didn't exist, because Mega Evolutions didn't exist. But, uh, apparently they just have something out against Sheninja in this game. That is so weird. Aren't they- well, I guess they're all- oh god. Hold on. Backing up. I guess they're all, like, wild Pokémon. So, they're not technically on each other's sides. Oh, by the way, any Monster Houses? Nope. I don't know if there are monster houses in this dungeon. Empowerment seed. Yeah, none of us can... Well, no, that's not true. Some of us can Mega Evolve. Actually, Hank could Mega Evolve. Kind of wish there was a Mega Golduck. I'm going to be really dumb if there really is a Mega Golduck and I just forgot about it, but I'm pretty sure there is not. I kind of miss Mega Evolutions. Although, at the same time, it also made it so that you really can only really use certain Pokemon to be viable. Kinda actually prefer Z-moves for that, and that, just in terms of balance. Because with Z-moves, pretty much every Pokemon can use them, but Megas, yeah, it was restricted to certain Pokemon only. Which, considering the design, like, necessity you need to do for Mega Evolutions, kinda makes sense. Just from, like, a logistics thing. Alright, anyways, where are we? Oh, good, they're right next to the stairs, too. Perfect. Okay, seriously, what do you have against Sheninjas? Alright, where are they? They're, like, down and to the left. Oh, I'm also hungry. Uh, we have a few perfect apples we could be using. We're not diagonal, are we? Nope. Still not. Also, at this point, I think Magnezone is actually stronger than us. Oh, thank god I'm not a psychic type. As a kid, I always thought that uh, Golduck was part psychic, but no, they're just water. It's just that they have, like, psychic type moves for some reason. Also, I just, reali I just realized we're not close enough for the other team members to hit them, can we? Or can they? They should be able to hit them now. There you go. Yeah. Oh, wait. That's the awakened one. I'm gonna use a normal Reviver Seed. Screw it. That's why this thing is hurting like hell. Hold on. It's a time to use this. Ooh. 
That's why that thing was so freaking powerful. Wait, that was the Awakened one, right? It's kind of hard to tell. No, that was not the time for Discharge. We just woke up all the Pokemon in the room. Also, Hank, oh my god, when did you get so much HP? Uh, what is this? This is a sleep seed. Well, you know what? That's actually pretty useful. Alright, so we got at least one Pokemon rescued. We need to go a bit deeper, though. I want to at least get to floor 12. Because that's where the other job is. I guess if we get that deep, we might as well just keep going. Because this, this dungeon's only, what, 15 floors deep? We could also just use... Oh, God. Back up. There is something happening behind us, isn't there? Well, not my problem. No monster houses. Yeah, I really need to power up the accuracy on these my moves. Discharge was the one I was focusing on because it was just so super helpful against water types. But Heat Wave is also just really good. There are some dungeons later that I'll probably have Hank take them instead of me. Just because of Heat Wave. Ooh, hello there. That might be worth it. Where are they? They're over there. Oh, yeah, since we used the big Reviver Seed, we also got all of our uh, PP and Hunger back. That's the difference between Tiny and Normal Reviver Seeds. Honestly, Tinies are fine. I just wanted to finally use one of my big ones. Also, yeah, that efficient bandana started to pay off quite a bit. Oh, do I have a camp for you? I don't have a Wigglytuff orb, unfortunately. I do have a camp for you. Cool. Also, yeah, I really should stop dashing. Uh, don't want another Mistrevis. You don't even have a rare ability, no. Actually, I could have brought them along just for the... Whatchamacallit? I can't think of the words right now. I can't think of words. Oh, just for just being able to do damage for us. Iron and a scope... Oh, a sticky scope lens. Why are these items all sticky? Well, we'll clean it up once we get out of here. Maybe I should have cut the cleanse orb on me. I guess we don't really need to use any of these items right now anyway, so it doesn't matter. Alright, anything good on this floor? Items. Well, we might as well just do a run down through- Oh! Hi there! Back up! In fact, you know what? Let's back up to a light room so that we can actually see what's going on. It's only dark in the hallways. Okay, seriously, what is it with you- Oh god, Mega Evolved. No, seriously though, what is it with all the Pokemon in this dungeon just hating Sheninja? Why Sheninja evolve the Pokemon to keep knocking out? Also, does anyone need PP? Uh, Hank, you can probably use some. Well, anyways, I found the stairs. Let's move on before we get attacked by a Mega Pokemon. Alright, stairs, where are you? Hi, Haunter. Wait, what? Oh, I was gonna say, how are you attacking if you don't know this Haunter is here? Hmm, Magnezone might need some PP soon. I see an item, or I see a, mo I see a monster house and a dangerous enemy. We are not going south. Got it. Who 
Where is that? I don't know where that is. There is a Mega Poke- Oh wait, we can just leave. There's a Mega Bennett somewhere on this floor, but I don't need to deal with it. Oh hey, look! It's the Team Punching Bag. I can't use any moves against you, can I? Nope, I don't have anything super effective. Hmm, maybe I should look into seeing- Seriously, is there a reason they hate Shininja? Yeah, they're all just attacking Shininja for some reason. Poor Shininja. There's no monster houses here, right? Nope. Alright, let's try to be careful, though. There is a dang... There are actually a couple of awake... No, I think there's only one awake in Pokemon wandering around right now. Oh, Discharge right now, PP. You know what? Discharge is way too good of a move not to have on. Back up. Back up so everyone can see. Alright, now where are... Where are these stairs? Oh, right here. Oh, 412, we have a mission here. I'm honestly surprised this rat had made it all the way here. That's really impressive. I got knocked out like twice already going through this dungeon. And no offense to that Rattata, but we are definitely a lot stronger than a Rattata. Uh, Duskull, sure. We don't have you yet, so come along. Oh, speaking of which, where are they? They are right next to us. Perfect. Oh, stairs are here too, also perfect. Alright, Rattata, get out of here. It is very dangerous for you here. We'll be following you shortly. We are literally three floors away from the bottom. Screw it, we're going all the way. We're in, and yeah, we're in pretty good shape. So no, we are not leaving yet. Hopefully that wasn't a huge mistake. What do we got here? Prison ban? No. We have plenty of those. Every time I hear that, I think something horrible has happened to my team. I'm also getting hungry. Let's try to finish this floor up real quick. I also have a guiding one I can... I also have a guiding one I can use if I really need to just find the stairs. You know what? That is actually pretty helpful. I'm gonna grab that. Uh, we don't need a chesto berry. Upstairs. Oh. Hey, Mega, Mega Sibli. You want to let us pass, but you know what? Nope, nope, not that. You, uh... Can you go away? Uh... Oh, you know what I think happened. Hold on. What's Sableye's special ability? Oh, uh, how do I look at the message log again? I know there's a way to look at the message log. I just never looked. Oh, there it is, message log. Hold on a second. No, not that. Yeah, they have Mega Bounce. Whoops. Well, you know what? It still worked out in the end. Note to self, Mega Bounce in this game affects wands. I was gonna be clever and knock them away so I wouldn't have to deal with them. All right, now let's just find those stairs. That's not my Pokemon. Wait, isn't that, like, right below me? No, that's not right below me. 
Do I have a guiding wand? I do. So I'm just gonna use it. I wanna get out of here. Uh, right down there. Perfect. All right, what do we got down here? We got a bunch of TMs. Oh my god, we got Dark Pulse. Ooh. Okay, these are all actually really good TMs. Let's start dropping a few things. Oh, you know what I could drop? Hold on. Where are my plane seeds I've been grabbing? Yeah, we don't need plane seeds. We got Shadow Ball. Sure, I'll take that. All good ghost type moves. Brutal Swing. I guess we'll take it. Might as well take all the TMs. There's no point in keeping them here. Uh, Plane Seeds. Snarl. I don't remember what Snarl even does in this game. But I'll take it. I have two... Oh, wait, no, I don't have two scope lenses. What do I not need? I guess we don't really need Cherry Berries and all these, like, Stas Berries. We have plenty of them. Drop an Orin Berry. And yeah, I'm taking the box. Okay. Oh god, I'm hungry. Hank, you take the lead. We're almost out. Well then, that was an eventful journey. Didn't actually mean to go all the way to the bottom, but kind of worked out in the end. And got nothing but rainbow gummies. And a toxic TM. Also, I think with this, we might have enough points to level up the team. If not, we'll be really close after two s rank missions. And we got a bunch of uh, ghost types, too. Did two detect bands, and you're joining me, right? Okay, yeah, we do have enough level. Well, we are now gold rank. We are now officially as good as Alakazam's team. Mm, still no toolbox size upgrade. I don't remember if there are any more toolbox size upgrades. Uh, X-ray specs, accuracy... Ooh. You know what? Those accuracy drinks are actually a really good grab. And now Mon Jr. can show up in dungeons. Okay. I guess we don't have Radita yet. Well, welcome to the team, buddy. Uh, calcium. You know what? I'll take the calcium. That's a good status item. Or, uh, yeah, stats. A good stat boost item. Also, now we have three eggs. Why are you level 14? We're in the post-game. Why are we getting level 14 recruits? You know what? We're never using them, but we now have three executors in our jungle. But yeah, those accuracy drinks, I think I'm going to pump them onto Heat Wave. Just to get its accuracy up, because it is missing way too often. Also, what do we got in the mail? Silver Cave? Sure, we'll grab that. Alright, but with that, I think we're going to wrap things up here. So, next time on Let's Play Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX, we're going to do some more side missions to make time pass. Also, now that we've ranked up, I think we'll have access to even more missions. But I'll have to check the board. So, till then.